What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Washington Nationals versus St. Louis Cardinals Major League Baseball matchup going down Saturday, July 6th, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. Also, make sure you check out my 2024 Major League Baseball Grand Slam Season Pass for the betters that are betting $1,000 or more per game on Major League Baseball this season. What it's going to get you access to is the weighting and rating of my plays for the first time. You're going to know where my biggest bets on the board are. It's also going to get you access to my nerfies and yerfies and my first five plays. Both plays I make throughout the day based on things like line moves, money moves, pitching changes, and lineup changes. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, that's the kind of bankroll that you're working with. Text Grand Slam to 443-780-5663 and we'll get you some more information. But let's get to this one between the Washington Nationals and the St. Louis Cardinals. The Washington Nationals sending out Mackenzie Gore for the start in this one, while the Cardinals will send out Lance Lynn and uh, Gore. You know, coming off of a decent start against the New York Mets, five and two-thirds innings, a one-run ball. Gave up five hits, had eight strikeouts in that one, and sort of got back on track after it was a really rough stretch over a couple starts for Gore, where he gave up nine runs in ten innings against the Padres and the Diamondbacks. But... For me, it doesn't get much easier here. You know, you take on the Cardinals, who, yeah, haven't had the greatest numbers against lefties in the last two weeks. But still, you know, they have a winning record against left team starting left-handed pitching this season, 13-10. and 10. You know, the, the Cardinals have started to play a lot better, you know, after a really rough start to the year. I mean, this Cardinals team entering Friday's opener, 45-41 and 41 on the year. A great step in the right direction after what was a very disappointing 2023 season. And a disappointing start to this year as well. Um, so I think the Cardinals will be able to get to Mackenzie Gore here, at least for a couple runs, and then get to that Nationals bullpen, which, you know, has been very shaky, to, to put it nicely. In the last two weeks, the, the Nationals have the second highest staff ERA out of the pen, 6.10. Now the Nationals, um, you know, they're going to have a decent matchup themselves here against Lance Lynn, you know, who does have a decent ERA on the road on the surface. But when you do some digging, you know, in his last five road starts, Lynn's allowed at least four runs in four of those five road starts you know if, if you count the um if you count the runs that were unearned you know lynn's era in his last five road starts would probably be closer to eight to, to eight or nine he's allowed 22 runs total in 25 innings of work and you know i think uh, i think lynn might have some issues in this start here against the nationals team that in the last two weeks against right-handed pitching you know has been able to hold their own i mean they you know it's, it's been uh, it's been the Nationals putting you know bat to ball in terms of team OPS. They're top ten. The isolated power numbers are top ten as well. The Nationals hitting two fifty seven, good enough for eighth in baseball as well. So this Nationals offense is coming to play over the last two weeks. I think they'll be able to do some damage against Lance Lynn, like I said, who's had some issues away from Bush Stadium as of late. So I'm going to take the over between the Cardinals and the Nationals. I think we got a, a high scoring matchup on Saturday, and that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're at Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.